Hey, it's Matt from Custom Car Grills here with a mesh install for the Porsche 991.1 with a GTS style bumper. Let's take a quick look at the mesh pieces that we have available for sale on our website. These are pre-cut specifically for the 991.1 GTS and sport design bumper. We have pre-installed a soft rubber trim that lines the outer perimeter of the mesh. And the mesh is a high airflow quarter inch hexagon design that offers great protection from small debris. There's also a notch at the top edge to accommodate a tab in the bumper to give you a perfect fit. We include the passenger and driver pieces in the set along with a dozen cable ties. Next up, let's get one of these installed. And don't worry, the bumper doesn't need to be removed. Make sure the mesh is oriented correctly and then just slide the mesh in from the top opening like so. I've pre-bent the tail end of the tie as close to a 180 degree bend as I can, about three quarters of an inch from the end. Then I'll push the tail end of the tie through a hexagon that's behind the horizontal bar as close to the outer edge as possible. Once it's pushed through a little bit, then the tail end of the tie can be hooked back around through a lower hexagon. With only a little bit of the tie coming through, I find it easy to pull the part peeking through with a pair of needle nose pliers. Now we can complete the loop by feeding the tail end through the head of the tie and then start drawing it in tighter. I like to have the head of the tie tucked as far inward towards the mesh and horizontal bar as possible to conceal it the best I can. Once I have it tensioned enough, then I'll grab some end cutters and nip off the end. After that, I'll repeat this process in a few other areas. At a bare minimum, I like to have four ties securing this on. One on each end of the horizontal bar will work good. We include some extra ties if the need for additional attachment points is required. Also, in regard to the ties, I got a sharp bend on the tail ends by crimping them with some pliers. To get the ties to loop around an adjacent hexagon, the tail ends need to have that super sharp, hard crease in them. Otherwise, they'll probably loop around a couple hexagons. The install is super easy with just a couple simple tools. Once installed, these ties blend in really well. Take a look at how this one turned out here. The flat black finish on the mesh makes them look OEM, and the hexagon design is a perfect complement to the car. Here's a picture of the install from a distance. I'm really happy how these turned out. Well, that's all I have for this video. I hope you liked it. And if you have any questions about it, then feel free to contact me. And thanks for watching.